Welcome back to the channel, guys. It is me, 8744. So, today, guys, we do my Champions League, Europa League, and Conference League predictions. We'll be predicting all the games this week, guys. So, please run and let me know your predictions in the comments below. Of course, there'll be league predictions in the description below for you guys to predict the games. And yeah, man, we're going to go ahead and get started, man. So, let's start with the Champions League first. We're going to start with Real Sociedad versus PSG. <laughs> Uh, PSG, man, there's a lot of drama going on out there killing Mbappe. Whether he's going to start this game or not, I have no idea. It's a difficult one. It's a difficult one to call in that sense. Um, PSG don't look inspiring. They look very, very average without Mbappe. And I think the big question ahead of this game is whether Mbappe is going to start or not. Because what I could see, see happening is this. We also see to take the early lead. And then Mbappe has to come on at some point. Because, you know, PSG is a potential chance to go out of the Champions League. And Bobby comes on and maybe he scores a goal. So, it's a difficult one to call. I'm going to say a draw. I'm going to say a draw. I'm not convinced PSG can beat Sociedad away. And I just feel like for me, Sociedad, they haven't been great in the last couple of games. They just don't score enough goals. And that reason, I can't see Sociedad knocking out PSG. So, I'm going to say 1-1 draw. I actually think Sociedad is going to score first. I think Sociedad will score first, but PSG will come back got the late equalizer and yeah and for my goal score for Sociedad it's difficult to say I'm gonna go with the midfielder I'm gonna go with the midfield I'm gonna go with Bryce Mendes I'm gonna go with Bryce Mendes to score the goal Bayern Lazio Bayern Munich you Bayern Munich and Thomas Tuchel you guys better not lose to Lazio at your own stadium even a draw is bad Bayern Munich have to win this because Tuchel's job is on the line here. Because if Bayern don't win this game, Tuchel is getting sacked on the spot. There's no way Bayern don't. Because Bayern, there's so much pressure, man. There's so much pressure. They just dropped points against Freiburg. Lazio just lost against Milan at home. Lazio is not great, guys. Defensively, they're not that great, especially on the road. I think Bayern's got this. It's going to be tight, but I think Bayern's going to do this. I think Bayern's going to win 3-1 and just about do this. But, man, Lazio, man, if they knock Bayern out of the Champions League, we're going to have to have, we might have to have an emergency stream. We might have to have an emergency stream if that happens. We might, just might have to. And I'm going to go with Kinsley Coleman to score the goal. Next up is Man City versus Copenhagen. Man City just obliterated Manchester United. Check out, uh, check out my YouTube short I did earlier today talking about that game more in detail. Regardless, Man City should win this. I think they're going to beat Copenhagen. It's just a matter of how many they're going to score. I'm going to say Man City score. I think it's going to be a 3-1 win. I'm going to go with Man City to win 3-1. Um, just like they did the first leg, and yeah, I'm gonna go with Man City to win three one. Actually, I'm gonna go three 0 this time. I don't think Copenhagen's gonna score. I don't think Copenhagen this time will score. Uh, but then man of the match for me, Holland seems too obvious, so I'm not gonna pick Holland, and I'm gonna actually go with KDB. KDB is my man of the match. I'm playing my booster for this one. Next is Real Madrid versus RB Leipzig. Real Madrid just had a very uh, difficult game against Valencia. It's a battle through to all a very controversial game. I also did a YouTube show you guys for that, so you guys can check it out. I think Real Madrid's got this. Um, I think Leipzig, for me, don't score enough goals for me. Defensively, are also very weak. I think Real Madrid's going to edge this. I'm going to say like a 2-1. I think they'll win this 2-1 against RB Leipzig and advance 3-1 on aggregate to the Champions League quarterfinals. And for my forwards, I'm going to go with Vinicius. I think Vinicius is going to be that guy to show up. Okay, now let's go to the Europa League one, guys. Europa League matchups. Okay. So predictions, Sporting versus Atalanta. Remember this, is the guys. This match will take place on Wednesday. I'm gonna go for a one-one draw. A one-one draw. Um, I just feel like for me, Atalanta um, are the better team, and I I don't know. I just don't feel. I just don't really trust Sporting on the road to get the job done. And yeah, next is Corbett versus Leverkusen. I'm gonna go with Leverkusen to win two 0 uh, yeah, I'm going to go, uh, actually, 2-0. Th I think I'm going to go with Leverkusen 2-0. They've been very solid. They just beat Cohen in the Derby, uh, recently. And so, yeah, I think Leverkusen's got this. I'm going to probably play my booster for this one. And I'm going to go with, um, so score the goal. I'm going to go with, uh, Florian Wartz. I think Florian Wartz scores at the first goal, uh, for Barley Luke. I'm going to play my booster as well. Roma Brighton. It's a tight one, man. Tight one. I'm going to go for another 1-1 one -one draw for this one. Um, yeah, I just feel like for me, Brighton's going to be good. And yeah, I think Roma's going to get the lead. But I think Brighton will come back. And I'm going to go Roma to goal score. I'm going to say Lukaku is my pick. 
Spar Proverbs to Liverpool. I'm going to go at Liverpool to win. I'm going to say Liverpool gets a job done 2 1 on the road. Kind of a scrappy win, but I think Liverpool's got this. Um, they'll get the job done. And I'm going to go with Dar- uh, Darwin Nunes. Darwin Nunes to score that goal. I think he's going to come. I think he's going to score like he did against um, uh, Nani and Forest. By the way, I did also do a YouTube trip that. So we have Milan versus Slavia Praha. I'm going to go with Milan to win this 3 0. Actually, I'm going to go 3 0. 3 0 Milan. Milan's got the job done. And yeah, I'm going to go with my first player to score. I am going to go with, for Milan, I am going to go with, uh, I'm going to actually say, hmm, I'm going to go Rafa Leo. I'm going to go with him. Freiburg versus West Ham. Very, very interesting one. I think I'm going to go for a 2-1 win for West Ham. I think they'll get the job done like they did in real life. And yeah, I'm going to go with West Ham to do this. I think West Ham is the better team. And I'm going to go with Jared Bowen. Uh, actually, I'm going to go kudos. I'm going to go kudos to score that goal. Kudos. All right, the Benfica versus the Rangers. Benfica looked very shocking, honestly. I'm not convinced with Benfica. And I'm tempted to go for an upset. I really am. Uh, but I'm going to go with a... I'm going to go for a nil-nil draw. I'm going to go for a nil-nil draw. Uh, just, uh, I think Rangers will get the job done, though, the second leg. But yeah, I don't uh, think it's going to happen. Okay, Marseille versus Villarreal. I think Marseille is going to win this. I'm going to say a 2-1 win for Marseille at home. Uh, I think Aubameyang is going to get the goals done. And yeah, it should be interesting. Oh, Pierre Emmerich Aubameyang. All right, conference league time, guys. Olympiacos versus Mikeba Tel Aviv. I'm going to go with Olympiacos to win 2-0 at home uh, to get the job done. Uh, I'm going to go Al Kabi to score the goal. Strong guys was Lille. I'm going to go at Lille to win 2 1 on the road. I was tempted to go for a draw, to be fair, but I'm going to go with Lille anyway, and I think Jonathan David will score. Um, score the goal there. Molde versus Club Brugge. I think this will be a high scoring game. Um, I'm going to say 2 2 draw. Um, I think Molde will score first just because they're home. And I'm going to go with Vetem Brescia. Ajax was Aston Villa. Honestly, guys, I'm not convinced with Ajax. And I'm going to go for Aston Villa to win this. I'm going to say Aston Villa wins this. 2-1 on the road. Uh, tempted to, I was tempted to go for a uh, maybe a higher score, but I'm going to go. I'm going to play be concerned. I'm going to be nice to Ajax. But Aston Villa should be able to go. I'm going to go with uh, Danny Ings. Actually, not Danny Ings. I'm going to go with Musa Diaby. I'm thinking Musa Diaby is going to score that goal. Uh, then Makeba Haifa versus Fiorentina. This could be a very tight game, guys. I think I'm going to go with Fiorentina win 1-0. Uh, I think it's going to be very, very cagey. I expect Makeba Haifa to be very defensive. But I think Fiorentina with enough quality, they should be able to see this through. And I'm going to go with Fiorentina win. And I'm going to go with the goal score. Is going to, I'm going to be... I'm going to go with Bonaventura. I'm going to go with Bonaventura as my guy to score. Dinamo Zaga versus Pulak. Um, I am going to go with a nil-nil draw. I don't think we're going to have any goals for that one. And I need to play my booster. And I'm... Okay, Union SG versus Farron Bache. I'm going to say this will be a draw. Maybe Union SG win, but uh, yeah, I'm going to go... With... Yeah, you know what? Now nah, I'm gonna play Al. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna go Union SG to win, but I'm gonna only go with one 0 win. But I think Farabachi will come back the second leg. Um, so I think Farabachi will probably win the second leg, maybe like uh, one 0 or two 0 or something. So I'm gonna go Nielsen to score the goal. Servette versus Victoria Pleasant. I'm gonna go Victoria Pleasant to win two 0 I'm not convinced with Servette, and I'm gonna play my booster for this one. Actually, I think I'm gonna play my booster. Uh, actually, first team to score, I'm going to go with Victoria Pleasant, obviously. And I'm going to go with Choi to score the goal. Yeah, and I'm going to play my booster. I'm going to play my booster. So uh, those are your predictions, guys, for this week's games, man. So let me know your predictions, comments below. Please remember to join the predictor, guys. Uh, remember, guys, to like and subscribe. And yeah, I'll see you guys later, man. Peace out.